I know. I know. Anyway. Hi, welcome to Anybody Who Ain't Anybody. My name's Tim Zagowski, and today we're in Philadelphia at the Philadelphia Convention Center, and we are sitting here with a couple of um, Philly roller derby, I don't know, skaters, girls, babes? Roller girls. Roller girls, okay. Because everybody has a different take on it, and I'm a guy, so I have to be real careful with that. Anyways. <laughs> And I, I'm, I'm not going to now just because of that. All right, and Robin Drugstores, welcome to the show. Thank you. Nice Midwestern accent. Well, I have one of those? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. And what's your skating name? Ivana Rock. <laughs> Ivana Rock. Excellent, excellent. And it's, very, it's very fun. Thank you. I never, I don't know, I had an accent, but well, I guess you, everybody you does. You said Robin like it was Rabin, like with an A. Oh, like Rabin. Really? Rabin. Rabin. Robin. Robin. Well, I'm going to stop that. I'm going to work on it while we're talking. Okay. I know it's Robin. Robin. And the name. But Joe. actually, call me drugs. That's what I prefer. That's that's what my friends call me. Call so now drugs. that you and I are friends. Now that we're too. friends. Yeah. yeah. Okay, drugs. You got it. Now, drugs. What got you into skating? What what made you come down and do this? Like come down today and do no, this? No, no. Or in, in, in order to get started in derby. Uh, kind of like a whim a friend of mine kind of told me it was going on in this area okay. and I was at a particularly angry phase in my life why doesn't um, that surprise me anyways uh, <laughs> <laughs> so uh, I found out when and where tryouts were made sure I could still roller skate and then oh, yeah. ordered a pair of skates online and came to try it it's really important I hadn't they, been on skates in 20 years I touched your leg accidentally I'm sorry about that yeah, it's cool anyway yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now how about you what? How about you? What got you into derby? Um, kind of the same thing. Just heard that it was going on. Had never skated before. Really? In my life. That's amazing. And got in on the ground floor with the Philly Roller Girls. Yeah. So. How long have you been skating? Uh, a little over five years. Oh, really? Over five years. What do you like the best about it? Hitting people. Hitting people. Mostly. Sandwiching <laughs> people. Oh, all right. It's fun. Yeah, I hear a lot of that. How about you? There's, there are so many things that make this for example amazing. Right. Yeah, hitting people is awesome. Yeah. Um, the game itself is way more strategic than I ever imagined it to be. Oh, yeah. Um, so there's a lot of like cerebral stuff going on. You know, it's not just like going out there and knocking people over. It's going out there and having a plan on how to execute that block on somebody to it's, knock it's an over. offense defense at the same time Correct. thing that most people aren't aware of right. and there are a lot of rules also that are still evolving because it's a new sport okay so every time you think you have your strategies mastered yeah. there's something new that you need to figure out how to work and and both of you being um, different size <laughs> All right. Anyway. No, no, no. It's like no. a funny thing. I know. Point. I know. I'm just trying really, to really, really politically correct. You know, people talk a lot down. about size in roller derby. I know. But and it really doesn't make that much of a difference. Well, there, there is a difference. I, I've heard different skaters. Thank you. I know. Size does not matter. <laughs> well, women, all right. Make up your belief. minds. Come on. Well, got not in derby. All right. Um, now, we got uh, smaller skaters like Mouse. Okay. You know, I interviewed Mouse. She was in Detroit a couple, three weeks ago. Being small, she can get in and out of some places that you may not be able to get out. I don't think that's true. Okay. I think that's more of an agility. Let me change that. <laughs> anyway. I, I mean, I've seen some, like, sizable skaters <laughs> be able to... <laughs> no, I don't mean that. I, you know, no, okay. I, and like people, it's it's a matter of agility. It's really not a matter of size. And but also with the ability. size, the difference is if you got the size, you might be able to go into a place where, you know, a smaller girl goes in there, she gets hit, she's on the ground. The girl with the size can absorb the hit. Well, see, that going. makes sense. That makes sense. All right. Uh, what I'm doing is learning. It's cool. And apparently I have a lot to learn. As do we all oh, every day, know. Tim. Um, <laughs> now you're skating. When are you? When's your team skating? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Okay. Eleven forty-five. Oh, all right. Nice. Nice. Um, how many bouts do you have in a year? How does that work? A lot. I don't know. It depends on whether we're talking like 
travel season or home season, which is like a, a complete different topic for a whole other show. Right. On right. who's not famous or whatever the show's called. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so, None of us are, yeah. <laughs> so, you know, we have like four home bouts a se per season, per year rather, which okay. is our home teams. And then the travel team. We've had 10 this year. 10 travel team games? 10 travel team games, but it really depends on scheduling and you know finances because we're doing this all by ourselves so right. you have to be able to travel to somebody who has the same date free is like in the right you know ranking that you would think it'll be a challenging game oh well yeah and um, um and, and it's really it really does change things detroit went to madison and lost Madison came to Detroit, and Detroit beat them by almost 200 points. Right, we were just talking about that. Just because Madison's team didn't have enough money to, they, they could go to Detroit or Philly, but they couldn't go both places. They didn't have enough money for So that's both. why they lost, you're saying, because they're poor? Yeah. Is that what you said? With a Midwestern accent, I said it, yeah. But I know there's Detroit skaters that would like to be here, but they didn't have the money. Number three. You had to travel and stay in a hotel and, you know. Okay. There's a lot involved. Well, yeah. Yeah. With a 10-hour ride from Detroit. 10-hour ride. A what? A ride from Detroit? It takes 10 hours to drive here. Oh! <laughs> I can't hear you. I know. Now. Now, do you, now, what do you do for a living? Funny you should mention that I got fired from one of my jobs today, today, nice. this morning. Um, but I was bartending there, and I'm also serving okay. at another restaurant. Now, how long, do you like doing that? Sure, yeah. You have, a, you have a personality for it. You know, okay. you can, yeah. Well, I mean, you, there, that would take somebody that can talk and goof off and be silly and serious. You got a job to do. But you have to be a certain amount of nice, but you got to be a certain amount of strong. I think the size helps a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't going to say that twice, you know. <laughs> yeah, thank you. How about you? I'm a server as well. Two what? jobs. Oh, okay. Well, we work together. Oh, really? Nice, nice. So you see her all the time? Yeah. You seem like your friends. Sometimes. And you seem like you like it way better than you like me. <laughs> That's pretty obvious, alright. Yeah. I feel like being friends helps when you're working together in the game of roller derby. Oh, well, yeah. You know, it seems like a real, a real close-knit group of women. What? It seems like a close-knit group of women. Absolutely. And that was, I was going to throw that out there as far as, like, things I like about roller derby. So it's like this whole community, this whole family, if you will, know, extended yeah. family all over the country, all over the world, really. All over the world, yeah. So, I mean, we could, like, email another team in another state or another country, you know, go to practice with them if we so desired. Stay with people for free. I mean, took a road trip last last year around this time, mostly for free because I was staying with roller girls who I'd never met before. Oh yeah. Now, okay, so I'm drawing a blank for the first time in my life. What? She's. She's intimidated. She's scared the shit out of me. Really yeah. intimidated. <laughs> I know. I make one little, you know, um, for the chauvinistic comment right away, you know. Uh, drugs, I want to thank you for sitting down with me. You know, it's very nice of you to do that. It's uh, you know, nice to meet you. And, um, you don't know, do you? What's that? That's it. That's it? Yeah, we're That's good. It. No, and okay. uh, what's your skating name? Ivana Rock. Ivana Rock. Ivana, thank you very much. Right, very very nice. You. Very playful. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go over in the corner and cry for a little bit. <laughs>